Hey everybody, my name is Old School Nerd. It is Content Creator Friday, and I thought, what better content than the creative people down in Deerstalker Pictures over there in Australia? One for all D&D comedy series. This time, the Paladin's back. So is fighting Strahd, fighting off Antrius's role for seduces? Probably both. Screen Australia. I think it's really cool that the Australian government supports creative works. I mean, could you imagine the U.S. government supporting D&D? <laughs> we can't even support ourselves. All right, here we go. Dear Stalker Pictures, one for all. The name of this one's called Choosing Between Good and Evil. And based upon our entire group of people, other than the pacifist bard, uh, barbarian, I'm sorry, pacifist barbarian, <laughs> the bard is never passive. That dude is roll seduce with loaded dice every episode i mean if dargle bark hadn't hooked up with that horse antrius probably would have that's how it's been going dude slow your roll you're becoming an a, a you're becoming a hollywood producer fast no no they're independent it's cool all right here we go your stalker pictures i cannot wait to see the paladin Wait. Yeah. Hey, nice of the night. Prepare for a smite. Ugh. You heard it? Ugh. Horrible paladin puns. There's only one thing worse than a level four smite, and that's a paladin pun. It's an unrollable skill, and it always hits, and it always causes a natural one. Another paladin. Why is it your kind always interrupt me Wait. right before a meal? Wait, is Kindle playing Strahd? <laughs> Kindle can play anything. Did you know that on the episode that you thought he wasn't there, there was this pumpkin off to the side on some haystacks? That was Kindle too. Did you know that? Bet you didn't know that. Yeah, the range. The range. Master! I mean, master. I'm not sure about the blue and the cape, but I swore it is not going to match the range. Antrius? Good for you. <laughs> what an unexpected surprise. Oh, fancy seeing you here. Bard, did the depths of your depravity know no limits? No. When it comes to the depravity, we are barely scratching the surface. Yep. Get back! Spawn of the shadows! <laughs> what I do? Tiefling, not devil. They're similar, but they're not. <laughs> I was dreaming of the day <laughs> another paladin would come to this table. Is he usually like this? Only to paladins. But to be fair, I mean, he lasted five minutes before he started hitting on you. That's a new personal best. <laughs> nice! I don't last so long. Okay, seriously, Forgeling, I, I just... Nice smile, Kendall. Five minutes? Wow. Congratulations. Wow. <laughs> uh, five minutes, that means he didn't use Bardic Inspiration. That's the only way that happened. He's like, I was out of Bardic Inspirations. I didn't need it a long rest and it didn't happen. Long. Don't you hate it when someone barges in on the nonce and murders all your dinner guests in cold blood? At least we vampires need an invitation before we enter. Yes, there's something Bard and a vampire have in common. She always asks for consent before we come inside. So you're telling me this isn't what it looks like? No, the Master's just having a few townsfolk over for dinner! <laughs> Yeah, the party they're never gonna forget for the rest of their life. Because they drank too much. <laughs> yeah, blood. <laughs> oh, bloody Marys. Bloody Marys. Don't, don't, don't. Um, tomato juice. So good. Uh, enough of this. Thrall, 
I melt a virgin. Bring me more, and I'll grant your wish of eternal youth. Coming, master. So that's what this is all about. He's trying to stay good looking. <laughs> The other day, I saw a wrinkle. Aw, there, there, <laughs> old man. Don't do it, Andreas. Don't turn your back on eternal paradise just to lurk forever in the shadows. An eternity with you would be paradise. What is wrong with living in the shadows? No more early mornings. You can stay up all night long. I do like lasting all night. Take my hand. Its heavenly touch will cleanse the evil from your soul. Lay those heavenly hands all over my body. Did I mention that all new vampires receive a free cape? Free cape? Oh yeah, stick those fangs into my neck. Join me and you'll live forever. Forever? No, join me and you'll also live forever. Who do I have to join to stop living? Andrews. Come here! Good Andrews! Andrews, come here! Good boy! Come to the line! Come, come, come on, on Andrews! Come on! Come on! Yes, yes, yes! Bad Andrews! Bad! Come on! No, no! Stay! Who's a good Andrews? You are! Say. You are good Andrews! Oh, oh, he's got tree! Yes. Tree! Yes. Andrews! He wants a belly rub! Andrews, come on, Andrews! He wants a belly rub! Okay, come on! I think this entire season five has certain things going on. Uh, Dargo Bark comes back triumphantly as a horse and then not a horse and then with a horse uh avandra wins a tournament but then loses it because she falls off of her best friend but i feel like season five is really about the evolution of antreus from low level pervert to high level sex offender i mean he's really <laughs> he has really upped his game um and now they're treating him like a puppy which is just a small dog. Enough! I need to have a good, long, hard look at myself in the mirror. Mirror, mirror in my hand. Help to make me understand. Well, my boy, it's come to this. The decision you make today will be the hardest choice of your life and should not be taken lightly. Wait, is that another wrinkle? Where? I choose eternal youth. Wait, where'd he go? He's gone. He's back. He's gone. He's back. He's gone. He's back. He's so fast. You do realize that vampires don't cast a reflection, right? My youthful good looks. If I can't enjoy them, no one can. I am disappointed, Thrall. But so be it. Vanity wins out in the end. Ain't that something? Vanity? Being the cause of a decision for Antreus? No. No such thing has ever happened. In the last three minutes? Oh, wait. This episode. Never mind. At least you'll make a good appetizer. Oh, you you missed my heart. Doesn't matter. Will not make that mistake again. Yeah, I see where my Kickstarter dollars went. <laughs> that was pretty good. The wings was one thing, but I have to say, whoever decided to make the halo instead of the halo popping, but the halo being a spike that comes out and then unravels, like. Till's wings on a Ramstein concert. Awesome. That was so metal. Yet holy. No, I want to see it again. I'm hoping that my Kickstarter dollars went to this. Right. Ah! Will not make that nice. mistake again. That was good. That was good. Whoa, this is like the most expensive fight I've ever seen. Yeah. It is. Do not think for a second that your sins will go unpunished. 
Oh, God, Freya, you punish me. Freed me from the hypnotic gaze of the vampire. And now we can be together. I'll take that lay on hands now. I knew it. I knew it. Close your eyes. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> that was so good. And that's another paladin gone. Okay, seriously, yeah, they've gone through so many paladins, it's ridiculous. They're like doctors in Doctor Who. There's like a different one every season. Here's the thing that gets me. Anybody else notice that the paladin's just like like Velma from Scooby Doo? Anyone? Just me. You know, you might not be a vampire, but you still really suck. Wow. Hey everybody, sorry about that. Um, I had to skip forward because I need all of you to go to the description right now, click the original link below, watch the original episode, give that one a like, a subscribe, share it with your friends, subscribe to Dear Stalker Pictures, and also watch the advertisement into that episode. I'm not part of that advertisement arrangement, so therefore I can't show it. But here's the thing, um, we're gonna watch uh, Kindle and Forgeling do the outtakes or the final part. Kindle. Uh, Kindle Drury and um, and Forgeling, yeah, that's that's their names on social media. You need to follow Dear Stalker Pictures, but more importantly, follow all the creators, uh, crew, and also all the amazing actors and performers in the series. Follow them on social media. Follow also all their side projects. Did you know that Kindle is not just a multifaceted, multi-role actor? No, he's also a musician and a few other things. Antrius. Did you know that Antrius is uh, handle forgeling? He actually is one of the best crafters of items, weapons, and gear for cosplayers that we know of. Nixie, Falls Cosplay. Yeah, what she's completely one of the best in the world at is the second half of her name. Do you remember the cleric? Also amazing cosplayer. Evandra, Eva DeVore, one of the best stage performers in Australia of a classic dance art. And Darglebark. Did you know that Darglebark? They're not just a druid that turns into horses and owl bears and bear owls. No. Their name is actually um, Jared. Jared is an amazing comedian. Yeah. So, me to you, dig a little deeper. Support Deer Stalker Pictures. Support One for All but also support all these amazing creators and performers in these episodes because they all work very hard, not only on this, but everything they do. And you'd be surprised some of their amazing hidden talents that you didn't know existed. And with that, I'm going to finish playing this out. Thank you for watching. And remember, the only virgins if they come from the virgin area of France. Otherwise, they are just sparkling incels. Speaking of virgins, we would like to thank our Patreons for all their support. And once again, thank you for Screen Australia for funding these teeth. That's where all the money went. If you liked this Ow. and are not a virgin, hit the like and subscribe button. Otherwise, you're definitely a virgin. Great, we forgot the Kickstarters. And the Kickstarters, the biggest virgins of the world. <laughs> 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 I'm happy with that. <laughs> and still, it's still a better love story than Twilight. Yeah, I know. All right, everybody. We'll see you later. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you enjoyed this video, give us a like. It really helps the channel grow. Also, if you want to subscribe, right there. Big thank you to all my Patreons out there. We appreciate everything you do. If you want more content like this video, check them out above. Remember, love one another, take care of each other. We're all stuck on this mud ball together. We'll see you later.